We turn now to the Russian invasion of Ukraine and tonight the urgent search to pull survivors from the rubble of yet another deadly rocket attack on civilians. At least 15 people were killed in the strike. This man was rescued and rushed to a hospital. 20 more people are believed to still be trapped in the ruins of the apartment buildings. ABC's Tom Soupy Burge reports tonight from Kyiv. Man, those are civilian buildings. Yeah, civilian building. Tonight, anger and fear amid a Russian attack. A missile has just landed, then this. A second strike caught in this video circulating online. Hours later, they're still pulling survivors out. Dozens thought to be trapped under the rubble. Hard to imagine that there were two high-rise apartment blocks here. The death toll of 15 tonight almost certain to rise. President Zelensky calling the attack Russian terror. Resident Irina saying they're scared of the night because they don't know what it will bring. But Ukraine says these US supplied precision high Mars rocket systems are scaring the Russian military. US officials saying eight now in action in Ukraine with a promise of four more. But tonight, a Ukrainian presidential advisor telling me 12 HIMARS isn't enough. It's better to have them not 12, but 112. It will change the situation on the front line dramatically and very fast. That Ukrainian official saying it's vital that Ukraine retakes territory in the south before winter sets in. Their fear that winter will create a deadlock, giving Russia time to consolidate its control over newly occupied land. Lindsay? Tom, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.